we are running out of time. What are you going to do with the time you have left? I say that if you don't reposition yourself, you could miss the best time in your life, in this season of life. This video, it, oh man, it, it speaks to me on so many levels. Um, first and foremost, I'm, I'm always trying to change the way I approach things, the way I try to change anything, how, how I overcome situations. Um, it's what I'm doing in my life. I'm, I'm constantly adapting and, and I'm trying to get somewhere. I don't, I don't know if, <laughs> if I'm the only one and I, I'm sure I'm not. Otherwise these videos wouldn't exist, but I haven't had it easy at, at all. I, I wish I could say I did. I wish I could say I grew up in a million dollar home and everything had been handed to me and and everything I've ever tried to do was successful and I've never failed at anything. <coughs> Excuse me. But that's not that's not the case. I I was adopted when I was two. Um my adopted family <laughs> they they weren't the nicest people. Um so I had a rough childhood, and then after that, I, I joined the military because, you know, I wanted to know what I was made of. You know, growing up, I was always kind of beat down and, and made to feel like I was nothing, so I, I needed to prove to myself that that wasn't the case, and I did. I went in and I did that, and I challenged myself. It, it's like he said, you know, you've, you've got to change your perspective, your, your outlook. You need to change wh who you are and where you're at, otherwise you're never going to be able to overcome the situations you're facing. You know, it's it's a really powerful video. Um, I've I don't know if it's this exact one, but I watch a lot of motivational videos. Uh, usually, in like if I'm if I'm not doing anything and there's nothing I need to be researching or trying to learn, and I just or maybe I just need a pick me up, I watch motivational videos. They they make me feel good, you know, make me feel real good. <laughs> But yeah, so I, I like this one because one of the things I worry about is, you know, I'm 34 years old and, you know, I'm, I'm not where I wanted to be, period. That's, <clears throat> sorry, I'm catching a little cold here, but uh, that's that's one of the biggest things is is I'm just not where I need to be. You know, when you're you're sitting there and you're thinking about something and you just know something's not right? Like that's that's how I feel about my life. I I just something isn't right, and I'm not one of those people that's gonna sit around and cha and wait for it. I, I'm gonna go out there and I'm gonna change it. I'm not gonna like the like the name of the video says, "Don't waste time." You know, I, that is exactly what I hope to achieve. I don't want to be, you know, old and gray and 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 I know that I didn't push myself, that I didn't get where I wanted to be because I just didn't give enough. No, I'm not going to be that man. I'm not going to be there. I'm going to be on my deathbed, happy, comfortable, and fulfilled. Fulfilled is the word. That is the biggest sense of achievement you can have is when you, you worked all day long and you lay down and you know you accomplished so many things. And that is when you know that you can achieve anything. You, if you keep going, you can find anything. You can overcome any obstacle. And that is why I love this video so much. The, the vocal techniques he uses, how he starts out kind of quieter, and then the more he goes, he, almost, he ends almost yelling. He's got a really deep, deep register in his voice, so it commands authority, and, and you listen. His pace is perfect. There's pauses in the right spots. It's something I'm not good at. I'm sure just watching, you're, you're, there are times where you're like, man, this guy is really trying. <laughs> but welcome to my life. This is what I do. And that's why I love these things. That's why I love this video. So what I want to leave with you isn't so... I, I want you to watch the video. Watch, watch the video. Watch the video. Okay, watch the video. But 
even if you don't, I want you to really take into account. You know, think of think of it this way. I don't I don't know what you do during your day. I don't know what you're gonna do tomorrow or what you've done in the past. But I know we've had days where we you wake up. And I'll paint a picture. I wake up and I I just don't feel like doing anything. You know, I I lay in bed for a while, scroll around on my phone. You know, just pulling one of these numbers, just laying in bed. Oh, Trump said something weird again. <laughs> you know, that's that's your morning. And then next thing you know, it's like 9, 10 o'clock. You get up, you maybe you make yourself some breakfast. And then you turn on a show that you want to watch or something. I don't know, maybe you just don't do anything that day. And by the end of the day, you, you've accomplished nothing. You've maybe watched a bunch of episodes. Maybe you watched a couple seasons of a show you like. You know, you ate some food. But you didn't, you didn't even make your bed, you know? So instead, picture this. So instead of just laying around, wake up. Instead of checking your Facebook, think to yourself, what do I need to do today? What do I need to do? Simple question. Give yourself five, six things to do. It doesn't matter if you complete them all. Five or six things to do. Mine generally looks something like this. I wake up, I want to complete my homework, do some readings or, or whatever. I'll do an assignment of some form, make, make a dent in, in what I'm working on. Um, I'm going to check to see if I have any jobs I need to complete for my graphic design deal. And then after that, I'm going to try and teach myself something new. So I get on YouTube, um, Skillshare, Linda, something, and then I teach myself something new. And then by then, it's probably about lunch, dinner time, some, somewhere in there, depending on how long everything took. Uh, obviously, I eat some food. And then I check on my friends. I just see how everybody's doing. Hey, guys, what's up? Maybe I'll go out and hang out with somebody, come home, and I'll tidy up everything. I'll, I'll make sure that my house is clean, my room is clean. Just make sure that everything is in the right order. And that's my day. I lay down, and the feeling you get is amazing like you you can lay there and just go man I did all these things today I feel accomplished you know I learned something new I did some homework learned something new I, I did I made my bed when I got up you know Heck, even if all you do is make your bed that's it man you just wake up and you do something so that even if that's the only thing you accomplish you can at least lay down that night and know you know what I made my bed this morning so guys gals Thank you for your time. I'll see you in class. And remember, make your bed.